Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So ever since I started uploading seriously to my YouTube channel, I spent a lot of time online looking for the next thing to review, just checking out all the websites, and also spending a lot of time getting distracted on social media. So I'm on Facebook, I'm on Instagram, and I get bombarded from all these ads, from all these sites that I just visited. And half of the time, those ads are specifically aimed at guy things, so specifically made for men. Uh, shampoos, deodorants, beard oils, specifically aimed at men. I'm looking at them, everything looks really great, but are they really? So that's when I had the idea to start buying some of these products that they're advertising to me through social media and uh, letting you guys know if they're legit, if they're worth your time and money, and overall, are they quality? And so yesterday, the first product arrived at my doorstep, and that just so happens to be the Bearsville Soap Company. So I wanted to check these guys out, see how quality these bars of soap are, and if you go to their website, they're obviously mainly aimed at men. So what do I think of this company? Welcome to the first episode of Guy Things. So checking out the website for the first time, I noticed that they offered 18 different fragrances. Um, I did not buy all 18 just to check out the company and to see how good they were. I bought four. So this is one of the first ones I got. It's Forest Fur. And what I wanna do is show you the four that I got to the best of my abilities, try to describe what each one of these smells like. And another reason I wanted to do this was I just get sick of the same over-the-counter products you buy off the shelves at Walmart. You know, the same products like Dove, Irish Spring, uh, Dial. If you're anything like me, my skin is super sensitive. I use this all the time just because it says men care on it. Does it mean it's any good? No, I use this and my skin gets really dry. I'm itchy when I get out of the shower. I don't know why I keep buying this crap. So I wanted to start looking at other companies, smaller companies that takes the time and they put some care into their products small batches versus extremely large batches just to put them out to the masses in a large retail store. They give you this little card, it says, welcome to Bearsville. And on the back, they thank you for your order. Here are the four that I got right off the bat. And I haven't used these yet. I'm gonna use these actually right after I tell you about them. And I'm gonna cut the video, go take a shower. Sorry, I'm not taking you in the shower with me and then come back and let you know how this actually feels if it dries my skin out like this Dove Bar did. So yes, this first one is forest fur, and then I got a peppermint tea tree. These two right here smell spectacular. I mean, I can't even tell you how good these two bars of soap smell. The first one is bourbon sandalwood, and I absolutely love the smell of sandalwood. That's why I wanted to get these two, and this one is sandalwood vanilla if you guys are familiar with this company and know these smells you know exactly what i'm talking about so on the back of the box it says our natural soaps are handcrafted with premium ingredients contain natural moisturizers and vitamins for healthy skin this organic soap has the distinct woodsy scent of a fir tree with essential oils derived from fresh fir needles. The addition of shea butter delivers a rich lather. So all these soaps are all natural, all organic. And it does say it weighs five ounces right here. So let's test that out real quick. Weigh it. It says 4.8 ounces, so that's with the box too. So that's close enough. All right, so the first one I'm gonna try to attempt to describe to you is forest fir. So. Man, it smells like eucalyptus mixed with fresh cut grass and a little bit of pine needles in there. Wow, that smells very refreshing actually. I mean, this smells amazing. So if you like those scents combined, you might wanna check out this forest fir. And then next, the peppermint tea tree. And it smells exactly <laughs> what it says here. It smells exactly like peppermint mixed with tea tree. But the next two are my favorite by far, and I cannot wait to dive into some of the other scents on this site. But this bourbon sandalwood, um, it's, I, don't, I can't explain, I just love this smell. This sandalwood mixed with bourbon. So on the back of it, it says, a rich oak barrel scent with amber tones and slightly spicy notes. Shea butter provides a rich lather. So it's a spicy kind of sandalwoody, oh, it's amazing. Guys, this is it right here. I cannot wait to use this. And then the next one might be my favorite of all. It's the sandalwood vanilla. Two of our most popular scents are blended seamlessly together. Sandalwood is combined with a hint of tempting vanilla. Shea butter is added for a rich lather. So, guys, I mean, take it from me. I hate food smells on me. Meaning, I don't even get the chapstick that's like vanilla or chocolate 
or strawberry. I don't like that. I don't want to walk around smelling like a cake. That's what I'm talking about. I don't want to walk around smelling like food. So I was really hesitant when it said vanilla in this thing. I was like, no, if it smells anything like vanilla, I'll pass. But mixed with that sandalwood, it is amazing. And as you can see here, it's a darker soap as opposed to the bourbon sandalwood. So I'm probably gonna use one of these two in the shower um, just to let you know how it lathers up. If I get dry or if there's any soap scum that gets left on me, so that's the whole point of me taking a shower and letting you guys know what's up with these. But what I wanna do first is go grab a big bowl of water and just pick one of these random soaps just to see how well it lathers up. Cause you guys can't see how well it lathers me in the shower. All right, so I'm gonna try the forest fur first. Yeah, I mean, this is what the bar looks like. This is, you know, it's just a big slab of soap. So you dip my hands in there and then kinda see what kind of lather we're dealing with here so yeah I mean I guess it lathers up pretty nice wonder how long that scent sticks around for after you wash yourself with this soap that's another thing the dial soap it kind of wears off after a while you see once I rinse my hands off in here see how filmy it feels okay it's not bad. It rinsed off almost completely. So that was pretty easy. So that's step one. I'm gonna pause the video. I'm gonna go upstairs, take a quick shower. I'm gonna use one of those uh, sandalwood soaps and uh, I'm gonna let you know how my experience was. I'll be right back. A few moments later. All right guys, I'm back. Just took a shower about 20 minutes later. And tell you the truth, I got out of the shower. My skin's not dry. I don't feel itchy. I used the, uh, the bourbon sandalwood, by the way. Smells absolutely amazing. I love this soap. And um, I don't feel sticky or I think it rinsed off pretty well. So I think this company is getting a thumbs up from me. I know it's just the first time using the soaps, but if that bourbon sandalwood is any indication of these other scents and these scents right here, I'm sold. All right, so let's head over to the website. And as you can see here, see, I strive to look like this guy. Scroll down here, authentic soap, all products, the Big Bear box, curated packs, subscribe and save, all that good stuff. So let's go to all products. And I mentioned before there was 18 different scents I saw the first time. So under all products, there's the bourbon sandalwood. And as you can see, they're all $7 a piece. So my four came out to be 28 bucks. Um, bourbon sandalwood, there's a citrus beer that sounds pretty interesting. Uh, campfire charcoal, cedar scrub classic sandalwood i gotta try that cedarwood and citrus have to try that forest fir i just tried that with the lather test in the bowl fresh citrus and herbs um peppermint tea tree i grabbed that one pine tar and balsam interesting peppermint and cypress scrub so they have two scrub bars from what i saw um the sandalwood vanilla i did grab that and ah <sighs> So good. Uh, smoking clove, I'm not too sure about that, but I have a feeling I'm gonna get every single one of these bars just to see what they smell like. Um, spearmint eucalyptus, spiced charcoal, tobacco flower, wow. Brand new vintage leather. Now, you guys know I love the smell of leather, um, but do I wanna walk around smelling like it? I'm not so sure, but let's just see what's up with this vintage leather. Um, unique scent of, let's say, and not to <laughs> centuries old durable leather goods like saddles, cowboy boots, the things that only get better over time. Well, that's true. This unique scent of antique leather is rounded out with notes of musk and sage, rich and masculine without any of the expected floral or dainty scents of traditional soap. See, that's why I like these guys. Shea butter and goat milk provide you a rich lather and maximum moisture. So, that might be one of the next ones I get is that vintage leather and then there's a woodland musk. Now I didn't get that four pack subscription right here just because I didn't like the four um, scents that were in there. I wanted to get four that I actually wanted for this initial review. But check it out, there's a nine pack subscription. Um, you got the big bear box right here for 63 bucks. What's up with that? My pick and choose, make it easy. Grab the ultimate offering of our natural soaps. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's nine soaps in that box. 
Pretty sweet. Outdoorsman pack, and you get the idea as you go down. Then there's moisturizers. Oh, wow. The bourbon sandalwood. Wow. So you have some. That would be awesome. So more moisturizers, some body balm. Uh, I mean, check this out, man. This bear soap lift is pretty cool. So I'm probably gonna end up picking one of those up too, just to have that little bear in my shower and I could put my soap on top of it. I think that'll be pretty sweet. So guys, I'm giving this company my stamp of approval. Um, I am hooked on the scents of these soaps. They just smell so damn good. And like it said, none of that dainty flowery stuff. I mean, it's bourbon and sandalwood and spiced charcoal, but it's actually a good smell. And based off my first showering with one of these soaps, I absolutely love it. Um, I'm probably gonna get every single one of these bars of soaps eventually. All right guys, that's pretty much it for this video. What do you guys think of my review of the Bearsville Soap Company? So let me know in the comments below if any of you guys out there actually grabbed some of the Bearsville Soap Company soaps and uh, what you think about it. Or after this review, are you gonna go out and uh, check one out for yourself? I wish I had a special code for you guys to put in my description box, but I'm not sponsored by these guys at all. And guys, if you did enjoy this video, please give me that thumbs up. Please subscribe and go!